why did you become a real estate investor? Someone told me about six years ago how they owned several different properties and because of that, they were able to make money and own their own time, do the things that they wanted to do. So when I finished homeschooling my kids and I was looking at what I wanted to do next, I wanted to explore real estate. Hey everyone, I'm Olivia from Houses Flipping People. I'm here in McKinney, Dallas today with Mickey, one of our top real estate investors, and she's ready to share her journey with you. Mickey, it's so nice to have you here with us. And how long have you been involved with real estate investing? About a year and a half. A year and a half. Mm -hmm. And do you have any experience before you became a real estate with our inner circle? I did not, not at all. Not at all. And with all the careers out there, why real estate? I like the idea, just like everyone else. You watch, you know, the networks on TV, you know, how they can transform houses. And I had someone in my family actually do that for a while, back when I was a young kid. Okay, and who in your family was doing real estate? That would be my father. Your father? Wow, that's cool. Yeah. Was him a full-time real estate investor? No. He was not? <laughs> no. Okay. He had a business, a side business, a furniture yeah. store, and he kind of did the real estate on the side. But he did it the hard way, where he did a lot of the work himself, and it would take years to transform the house. But how old were you back then? Six, seven, eight. Okay. But that's good that you still have an idea and memories growing up and seeing your dad doing it. So for you right now, it's just looking back a flashback and forth because yep. you are actually doing the same step, but you're not actually doing what your dad was doing, putting hands on, on the project yourself. Right. So now you are, well, how are you doing right now? A little bit easier. You know, we have teams that come in and help transform the homes. Mickey, so our first deal, we never forget. So right. share with us, how was your first deal? Uh, it was a floor closure and I was door knocking and I drove up to the house and there was a woman walking across the street from her friends and I approached her and asked if it was you know the woman that I was looking for and she said can I help you and you know I remember the script from Phil no I'm actually here I'm hoping I can help you so she immediately said bless you I hope you're the one that can help me that is fantastic. So what is the script that you told you or that you remember from the workshop? I remember him sharing how he would get on the phone or, or visit with someone, yeah. knocking the doors actually, and they would say, you know, can I help you? And he indicated, no, I'm actually here to help you. So, so that's awesome that yeah. you remember and you are actually using that on your daily basis. Yeah. So how much money did you make with that particular deal? 40000 since the day that you approached that, that lady, how long did it took you to actually to be able to close that deal? How many yeah. doors did you knock on that day? What is your main marketing today? 